Here is the fastest and easiest way to make money with digital real estate and how I literally use this method to pull in $30,000 a month in passive income. So back when I was younger, I would constantly see my parents fight about money all the time. You know, constantly fighting about money. They're always like at their job, at each other's throats, just like, we don't make enough money. We have all these bills. And earlier on, I just realized, okay, I need to go ahead and find a way to create passive income. I need to find passive income because when people in my life don't have money, they fight. They literally go ahead and fight. So obviously that went and allowed me to start pursuing real estate. Now the only problem with real estate is what did I need to go ahead and do? I need to go ahead and for example, like either get my real estate license, I need to go ahead and get a big mortgage, I need to go ahead and find a tenant, for what? for $200 a month in passive income. Like if I'm gonna go ahead and get like some mortgage from the bank and I'm gonna go ahead and say I have to pay like for example, like $1,500 a month mortgage and I find some person to live in my house for like two grand and I'm collecting $500 a month in passive income. That is a lot complicated for just what? $500 a month in passive income, $200 a month in passive income, $100 a month in passive income when in fact there is a way that that same concept that works in the traditional real estate world can exist in the digital world. And if you go out and create these assets online that are digital real estate, you could essentially make $100, $200, $300 a month in passive income with digital real estate without the headaches of, for example, going to the banks and getting a mortgage, without dealing with annoying tenants, without actually getting your first property or your second property, without all the crazy complexities with real estate. So how do I go ahead and do this? Well, one of the ways that I'm gonna show you is literally how I went and did this to make $30,000 a month in, for example, passive income. And it's not really that complicated, right? Again, the goal is to find out where are good pieces of real estate online and how you could actually go out and make money. So again, how many go out and relate this to real estate? Let's, let's talk about like McDonald's. So who do you think will make more money? When you go out and create a McDonald's, do you think you're gonna make a lot of money in this intersection where there's a lot of people driving to and from work every day or in like nowhere where there's no traffic or no cars driving in front of them? Probably the more traffic of cars the more money you make with that McDonald's. Does that make sense? And it's the exact same thing. Same with how there's more eyeballs driving in front of this intersection, more traffic in front of this intersection compared to this intersection. It's the exact same thing online. Where, same with how there's addresses, people come online to places like, for example, Amazon, type in all of these things. You see all these things that pop up, right? These are literally addresses online where if you could start developing land around these addresses or keywords that people are searching for, and you either put products or services or advertisements on top of that, you could essentially make money. So let's actually go start from the most beginner stages of, for example, digital real estate to the highest level of stages with digital real estate. So if you wanna go ahead and make $100 a day in passive income, $5,000 a month in passive income, seven grand a month in passive income, 10 grand a month in passive income, you could slowly start stacking your wins up there. So the first level one baby beginner digital real estate is just on Amazon, right? Like, do you see that there's all these things that people are searching for, for cats? So literally back in the day, you could go ahead and, for example, say something like cat t-shirt. And I remember I was like selling a bunch of cat t-shirts in the past and I was making like $700 a day in revenue. But check this out, about like $300, $200 a day in profit, right? If I type in all of these cat t-shirts, these are what people are searching for, right? So let's just do cat t-shirts for women. And if I just come in here, there's literally t-shirts that are there for like seven reviews. And this is on Amazon, right? And mostly, when people think about Amazon, they're like, I need to go ahead and buy a bunch of product from China and spend million, like thousands of dollars on inventory, money that I don't have, right? Money that me and my dad didn't have when we were getting started. And let me just then throw it up and try digital real estate. But what if there was a the better way? Because literally, same way how people are going in and doing this, you can literally throw pictures up on, for example, Discord, right? Discord, this thing called Mid Journey, it's this artificial intelligence robot where you can literally just go ahead and have them create some type of picture. And they get, like, all of this is artificially intelligent design, right? You could then take any of these pictures, say you want a picture of a cat or a dog or whatever. You could then throw it up on this thing called merch.amazon.com where you could upload your artwork, artwork that you literally just got an AI robot to do. Suggest so a list price, we print what's sold, fast shipping with Prime, earn monthly royalties, and before you know it, you're literally going ahead and off to the races. You have a product on, for example, Amazon, where you have digital real estate. 
Now, the best digital real estate to develop is the ones that when you go out and search for something like this, there's very little reviews. Because if you have something like, for example, I remember back in the day, I was trying to create digital real estate with grill mats, right? And I was like, if I could get a grill mat to make me $100 a day, that'd be good. But it was just too competitive. That's like you be like, I'm gonna go develop land in New York City, literally in the center of it all. It's just too late. It's too late. Oh, but let me go ahead and build it. I don't know. In like Austin, Texas, like five years ago, you see that it's like you're the one that develops the land. When you develop the land online, it's so much easier, right? So obviously, this is just a very easy and free way to get started. You know, you can literally go ahead and sign up for merch.amazon for free, upload your artwork, suggest a list price. Amazon does all the hard work, they do the shipping and handling, you earn passive income. And the goal of this is. Understand this, one of these t-shirts can make you $100 a month in passive income. Just imagine that. One of these t-shirts can make you $100 a month in passive income. Oh, but my real estate makes me $200 to $500 a month in passive income. So, you got a mortgage, you're dealing with an annoying tenant, you're managing all these properties, someone clogs the freaking toilet, calls you, now you have to plumb someone's poop out of the toilet at 3 a.m. for $200 to $500 a month in passive income, or you just get like one, two, three, five of these t-shirts, have make $100 a month in passive income. Now you have digital real estate, now you have a port, like same way how you would have a portfolio of homes and addresses and real estate that you're renting out to tennis. You'd also have a portfolio of t-shirts, a portfolio of some type of asset online of some digital real estate that you could essentially start selling. Does that make sense? So that's just one way. A second way that I had a friend make 10 grand a month. And when you find out, it's so freaking ridiculous. He was making 10 grand a month. He was traveling around the world. He was doing it with his girlfriend. He was working remotely. He was doing it abroad. He didn't have a boss. Was literally writing werewolf love stories on Amazon. You're probably wondering how. I'm not a writer. I'm not an author. How'd I go? A lot of this is just digital real estate. Again, I type in werewolf love. Triangle books, people are searching for this, right? I can literally go to ChatGPT and type me, write me a werewolf. So I'm literally going ahead and just, I just talked to this, you know, AI artificial intelligence and now it's like writing this entire story for me, right? Break it down, break this down into 12 chapters. Look at this, break this down into 12 chapters. So now I literally just talking to this AI robot thing it's going ahead and making all these things. Oh, some of these chapters are a little bit longer. Cool. Let me uh, expand chapter two to 1,000 words. The enigma aura. The enigma aura, right? It's like Greg's heart race as he watched Maria from a distance. Her dark hair cascaded down. Her like it's just weird, right? But you literally can go out and use AI and artificial intelligence now, and just go ahead and create eBooks, right? But you're probably a little mic. I don't want to go ahead and be known for something that, you know, like makes werewolf love stories. I want to feel fulfillment. I want to go ahead and make money where I can just work abroad, travel remotely, work remotely, make five grand a month, 10 grand a month. Is there a faster and easy way? Where there is, where there's someone like Cam who made $25,000 in a single month when he used to only make two grand a month at his job that was slowly just showing his soul. If you want to know exactly how he was doing it, then I highly recommend that you sign up for the brand new silver lining method on how you can make three grand and 10 grand a month profit with just a smartphone in as little as eight weeks without having to start a business, show your face on camera, putting yourself out there on social media, creating content, running expensive ads, building complicated sales funnels or websites, or learning any of the hard skills. And in fact, this high income skill that if you go out and sign up for the free workshop below is one of the fastest and easiest ways to put five grand a month in your bank account right now. So sign up for it in the free link below. But yeah, that's just like one way, you know, chat GPT. And then you can literally go ahead and take all of these words, throw it up on kdp.amazon.com and literally go ahead and start self-publishing eBooks for free. You don't have to be a writer, right? Like I remember back in the day, I was like, oh, I wanna go ahead and write a book. So I remember like spending a long time writing this book, I'm like hopefully people are gonna wanna buy it, hopefully people are gonna wanna buy it. And not a lot of people actually wanna go ahead and buy the book that I ended up writing, right? They're like, oh, well, uh, I don't wanna go ahead and, buy. like people just don't wanna buy it, right? And back in the day before like artificial intelligence and AI existed, it's like, you literally have to do all of the manual labor, you literally have to go ahead and do all the hard work, right? But now there's literally people writing werewolf love stories with AI and artificial intelligence and chat GPT, not making passive income from this. Again, my goal in the beginning was, I was like, I didn't care about making millions of dollars. But if I could find a way to make $100 a day, $5,000 a month, man, there's so much avenues that you could actually make money now with digital real estate, right? Another way is literally just doing the exact same thing with Amazon, right? Amazon, the moment you start realizing and you're starting to build confidence with digital real estate, what you can do now is own more of the supply chain. So it's the exact same thing, for example, in real estate where it's like, oh, let me go oh, own the land. Cool, all of these people are now renting on my land. 
They're building businesses on this on my land. Cool. Now, all these people are renting on my land. Guess what I'm gonna do? Who's making the most money? With the money that I'm making from the profit that I'm making from the people renting my land, I can then buy the business that essentially is really profitable because they're on my land. Does that make sense? And this is what people are essentially doing with just attention. So check this out. There's like literally people going ahead and creating like, for example, YouTube videos. They're showing their face on camera and then they're like ranking for waist trainers. And guess what they're doing? They're literally going ahead and making all these waist trainers that they essentially got from, for example, Alibaba.com with Amazon FBA, right? Waist trainers belt and a lot of these things they go for like four to five dollars to eleven dollars they're selling these babies for like what is this way more 28 30 bucks all these different things right 28 bucks 37 bucks so what people are essentially doing is they're like okay well I could double dip. I could go ahead and realize that there's digital real estate here, but guess what? There's also digital real estate on, for example, YouTube, waste trainers. And essentially what they're doing is the land, all it is is attention. Digital real estate, same how you have real estate on physical property. The property now that people, the matrix is essentially trying to control is the real estate of the mind. And if you could go ahead and control the real estate of the mind via YouTube videos, via ranking on Amazon, via whatever, you can make money. Here's an example of this. Like, I remember, like, I did the exact same thing, but for jump rope. Do you see all these pieces of real estate? I was like, okay, there's eyeballs here. Let me go ahead and own the attention of this keyword. I got nearly a million views on this. I could have easily went over to Alibaba, type in a jump rope, because I have the attention, and I could literally just get a bunch of these jump ropes, throw it up on Amazon, Instead of 70 cents, which is my cost, I sell it for $10, $20, $30. Now I have the business, but it's because I got the attention. Does that make sense? It's because I got the attention. And because of that, people are like, oh, we wanna go ahead and run ads on your videos. And I was like, oh, cool. All, like, I had all this attention. All these business owners were like, let me rent your land. Let me rent your land. So they're renting on my land, and I'm just making all this digital real estate. And before you know it, Google AdSense is paying me 35 grand to 46 grand a month. But obviously, if you're like, oh, Mike, I don't wanna show my face on camera. I don't wanna put myself out there on social media. Well, obviously, the fast and easiest way to get started is literally then starting with the brand new silver lining method. We wanna find out how Cam was able to go from zero, actually was able to go from two grand a month at his job that was slowly killing his soul to literally 20 grand a month. Sign up for the free workshop below and I'll see you guys on the other side.